Toronto FC faces off against one of their biggest rivals in the 4-1 Derby this Saturday against the Montreal Impact at Stade Saputo. Welcome inside painting the picture presented by Benjamin Moore. Marie Papadak is here getting you all set up before kickoff. Toronto FC may be coming off a 2-0 loss against the LA Galaxy, but there were positives to take away from the match. Toronto FC controlled the majority of the ball at 60% and outshot the Galaxy on the night. The Reds created dangerous opportunities, but it was Latan Ibrahimovic who proved to be the difference, bagging a second half break to deny the Reds a win on the road. Head coach Greg Vanny likes the way Toronto FC is heading and with a week between matches, they have had time to continue to work and build on things they're focusing on. As the rest of the Reds return from Gold Cup duty and with new additions to the club this week, the squad will be looking more complete heading into Saturday. As the transfer window has reopened, U.S. international defender Omar Gonzalez has officially been added to Toronto FC's roster. The towering central defender has returned to the MLS after four years of playing in the Liga MX. Although signed in June, Omar Gonzalez has had his chance to get familiar with a few of RTFC veterans Josie Altidore and Michael Bradley during Gold Cup duty with the U.S. men's national team. The three-time MLS Cup champion and four-time MLS Best 11 defender will provide stability and experience the defense as well as an aerial presence in set pieces. Strengthening that back line will go a long way for defensive improvement in the second half of the season. More additions to the club this week as Toronto FC have signed winger Erickson Gallardo from Venezuela inside Zamora FC. The 22-year-old is a dynamic player, a good crosser of the ball, and is dangerous in 1v1 situations with his blazing pace. Heading into the weekend, you may see these new additions into the lineup as well as some of your returning Reds. This weekend's opponents are coming off a back and forth match last weekend. It started out as a great night for the impact as forward Anthony Jackson Hamill opened up the scoring in just 27 seconds into the match. However, it was Minnesota United that came back to take the three points on the night in a 3-2 final. Montreal struggled defensively on the night, allowing themselves to get beaten on the run on multiple attacks. Montreal heads into a midweek match against the CPL's York 9 FC for the third round of the Canadian Championship ahead of Saturday's match at Stade Saputo. Montreal sits at fourth place in the Eastern Conference tied with Atlanta United FC with 30 points. In the last two meetings in Montreal in 2018, Toronto FC fell short to the impact. A new season with a week's rested squad, Toronto FC is ready to head across that 401 to take the three points in their first road match against Montreal in 2019. Saturday's kickoff is for 7.30 p.m. on TSN, so make sure you tune in to support your Reds on the road, and thanks for watching.